them. You know how sometimes you tell people, listen, if you do this idea, you'll get a lot of benefit from it. Or you say, buy this software. It'll make you more productive. If nothing is happening here, they're not motivated by benefits and goals. They're probably motivated by avoiding a problem. So if you're selling software to someone, and you say, listen, this software is going to prevent you from wasting all the time that you waste now by doing repetitive activities. If they have an away from trigger, that's going to be much more motivating. So you need to talk about what you will prevent and solve. Now, if you stand back and think about these two for a moment, which of these two triggers is more urgent, gaining a benefit or solving a problem? If you haven't started working on something that's important to you, maybe it's not urgent enough. See, fixing a problem is much more urgent than gaining a benefit. I think about the, uh, it makes me think about Toady Fields. She's been dead for years, an American comedian. She wrote a book on dieting. It was called, I Think I'll Start on Monday. You know that Monday never comes, right? So she has this goal of going on a diet and never starts. Why? Because she hasn't looked in the mirror and discovered an urgent problem. Shelly wakes up, looks in the mirror, and goes, oh my god! That's urgent. So you can see that it's uh, different motivation triggers give you different, different benefits and different problems solved. If you can't get started on something, it means you have nothing to move away from. If you get started on something and you have a goal, that means that you're motivated by that end goal. I, in fact, I've noticed I have a very away from trigger about my work. So, Sandy, would you ask me, uh, Shelley, why do you set goals in your work? Because I do set goals. Shelley, why do you set goals in your work? I love audience participation. <laughs> Thank you for asking that, Sandy. Well, the reason I set goals in my work is because I hate being disorganized. Now, if you stand back and think about my answer, the goal is not the motivating factor for me, is it? I'm trying to avoid being disorganized. So why do I set goals? Because I can't see my desk. And it needs clearing up. Do you know what color your desk is? Yes. 